<laughs> you already start to laugh because you're thinking, hmm, for two months I only ask him about new players. And um, I constantly told you guys how many quality players we already had. Uh, and um, I think you all, all knew. Uh, and that's also what we showed in the last weeks and today again that we have many quality players. What, what pleased me most is that even if a lot of new players come in, they don't come in and try to have a good individual performance. They try to work uh, really hard for the team because there was a lot of desire not to concede. Uh, and as a result of that, we had some good individual performances as well. Yeah, yeah. I think uh, Jogo deserved it because he played a lot of good games for us already. Uh, and if I'm correct, he was only on the score sheet in the first game against Ipswich. Uh, but he's been important for us in every single game he played. Uh, but a striker all, also wants to score goals. Uh, so I'm pleased for him that he scored two today, although he played on, on, on a number 10 position. But um, he scored two really good goals. And Cody... Um, I think it was 10, 15 minutes or 20 minutes before the end where he cleared the ball in his own 18-yard box. And um, that is also what he brings to our game, apart from scoring too, because if I see him in training, the way he hits the ball in and around the 18-yard box is with incredible speed. So I'm not surprised him scoring like this. And Tony just told me that he scored an exact similar one last season in this cup tie against West Ham. So. Not a surprise to see him score, and not in, not in the way he did. But uh, it's not only about them scoring; it's only also about them defending in their own 18-yard box. Got um, Brighton away in the next round, just beat drawn out. Just Ooh, Brighton down. away. Brighton away. Okay. So again, a difficult draw. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, you, I think there were almost all the teams that were still in. Or strong teams, and you know, if you wanna, if you wanna win a trophy, or if you wanna win this cup, then you will play against difficult opponents, which was West Ham tonight as well. I would have preferred to play at home because in our schedule it's uh, already so tight and so many games that you would prefer not to travel. And if I'm correct, Brighton is not next door, so uh, it's uh, quite a far away game. But uh, quality team to face again. Yeah, I was pleasing to see that he could play already 60 minutes because um, I think I said at the last press conference that he hasn't played a lot, maybe hasn't played hardly any minute in the last three or four months. So for him it's important to get, apart from uh, uh, getting more match fitness, is, is one of the things is that he has to have playing minutes and that's what he got today. Uh, he assisted. Although it was a shot on target that uh, was promoted by Jogo to a goal. Uh, worked really hard. Um, I think it's normal that, um, that he's not already in the top of his uh, uh, ability. He has to get used to the club, he has to get used to his teammate, he has to adjust to the playing style. But it's very good to see how match fit he already is, so that we can use him uh, if we need him. Yeah. Um, everyone knows quality, but maybe towards being in the same fit, like muscle injuries. How do you make sure it doesn't happen with the same fit on the sideline? Rotate. <laughs> uh, no, I think we are trying to manage his minutes like the others in the best possible way, but, but we also try to prepare him during the week and during the first months of pre-season to prepare them for so many games in the Premier League, but it's sometimes there are small margins, sometimes you can be unlucky as well. If you saw what happened with, uh, with Rotary, yeah, that is so, so unlucky um, for him. So it's, it's trying to prepare them in the best possible way, uh, but, but in the end you need a bit of luck as well. But what the players can do is be as professional as possible, live, live in the best possible way for their uh, career. And I think uh, that's what they've done till now, and that's what they're doing at the moment. And we, as a staff, try to prepare them in the best possible way to get without injuries through these periods. Um, 
Hold on. Hold on. Okay. What are the other games? Are we the only one?